I finally found the best vanilla cupcake recipe and I'm gonna share it with you. And I'm sure there are a lot of bakers out there thinking, Joe, I've been using this recipe for 25 years. Well, I've only been alive 22 years, so give me a chance to catch up. It's the egg weighing method and I use this for my cakes and I don't know why I haven't been using it for my cupcakes because it's perfect. You weigh three eggs and whatever they weigh, that's how much butter, sugar and flour you're gonna use. So my three eggs weighed 176 grams. So I used 176 grams of butter, 176 grams of caster sugar, and I mixed them together in a bowl until they were pale and fluffy and added my eggs one at a time mixing in between. I then added one teaspoon of vanilla extract and two and a half tablespoons of milk and I mixed that together. Yes, mine looks curdled, it's because my eggs were straight out of the fridge. I keep my eggs in the fridge because I sell my cakes and it's safer to keep your eggs in the fridge. Don't bother putting in the comments, it's curdled because this, that and the other. It's because my eggs were cold, I'm telling you that right now. So, thank you. Then you want to sieve in 176 grams of self-raising flour and a quarter teaspoon of salt. And then you want to fold it in very carefully, making sure to knock out not too much air. That was not grammatically correct, but we'll go with it. Um, then you want to line your cupcake cases. No, your cupcake, what do they call them? Tins, mine ain't tins though, mine are moulds, cupcake moulds. Whatever you've got to cook your cupcakes in, just line them with cupcake cases. And you want cupcake cases that fit your tins or your moulds. I used to use ones that are too big and they would fold in and they would peel away from the cupcakes once they were cooked. And that's not what we want. We want ones that fit perfectly. And then I just used spoons to evenly distribute the batter out into the 12 cupcake cases. And I don't know about you, but putting batter into cupcake cases is so therapeutic for me. I just love it. Proper calmed me down. Um, so I've really enjoyed this part. Ah, anyway, you wanna put these in the oven at 180 degrees Celsius. Um, that's not fan, that's conventional. Um, for about 25 minutes until they come out golden and a skewer comes out clean. You know the drill, cakes and all that, we all know. Um, and look, they're just beautiful. They're not flat. I've never understood why people want flat cupcakes. I don't, I really don't get it. Can someone tell me why you want flat cupcakes? Surely you want a bit of a dome on them. I don't, I don't get it. Anyway, these are gorgeous. They're not greasy around the edges or on the bottom. They're spongy and they taste bloody delicious. So I'd give this a go if I were you.